Hello, welcome to the channel. If you haven't seen part one, episodes one through four, the video will be right up here. Let's begin with episode five. We will be finishing today. I'm really excited. Let's get to it. I thought it was dead meat. Special. You should brand me. All right. Yeah, let's do it. Doesn't this have to be like official, you know, like a ceremony? Guess not. <laughs> His scream. Oh, shit, that would burn. I love them. They're so sweet. I just realized that he's not going to be the same when he finds out. Before we go back to the base. To the base? <laughs> I'm officially your squire now. You can tell me anything. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. That would feel so... That would feel so violating. You know, this whole time he thought he was someone else. We can still be friends. Not like this. Personality Titus. He's dead. We just have to get our story straight before we go back. You are being so creepy. So what are you going to do? Kill him? Oh, He's a bit of a sociopath, isn't he? I'll fucking kill you, Thaddeus. He should have. Well, you tried. Okay. I'm starting to I'm starting to think that my initial idea of him was correct. Um yeah. What's that? Oh, I mean they're not going to get through the armor. But they look they look mechanical almost, don't they? What's that? Oh, what's it that? Oh, of course, Lucy. That was so game-like when she shot those. That was you, right? Back in Philly? The night? I really want to trust you, but... I mean, he already saved you. You can trust him. Maybe. You have radiation sickness. Oh, I, I got right away, please. I saved your life. I'm no Titus. Oh, my God. I'm no Titus. I was wondering if that was going to come into play, the, radi the radiation. She was going to get radiation sickness. We know what's in there. If anybody asks what we were, I'll have a heart attack. You need a plan and you need no, to I'm discuss it. Let's get your story straight. You guys have more of those T-60s and guns? You can't just borrow them, you know? <laughs> You're not from a place where the worst someone can do to you is forget to say thank you. Sounds like a nice way to live. Nothing like here. I am literally stunned by what just happened. Um. Uh, I'm stunned. Um, the fact that he was just going to kill him right then and there didn't really try very hard to explain. I understand he's scared and his life is literally, literally in danger right now, but I don't know. I just can't shake. I'm very unsettled. I'm very unsettled by him. I was going to start off this this video with a with a little disclaimer because I felt bad while I was editing. I felt bad. I felt like I was a bit too hard on Maximus um, because while I was editing, uh, he, he's very funny. You know, his dorkiness and goofiness, it made me feel bad um, that I didn't say more. I felt a bit that I was a bit too harsh on him, but now I don't know. I don't know. Is he a sociopath? Like really like deep down? That was just crazy. Yeah, I, I, I'm just, I, I can't help but but think to myself, is this the fall, is this the true fallout way, you know? Because, you know, you get so used to when you watch something, your main characters, they're always good, but we know that that's not what fallout is like. Are they, I don't know, I, I'm just, I've got a lot going on in my head right now. I need to, I need to just focus on the show. So let's keep watching. <laughs> Oh shit, they're voting. Interesting. God, this reminds me of that one vault where they had to vote once a year for someone to die. Fuck. That's fucked up. I'm sorry, Reg. No hard feelings, Davey. Isn't it an anonymous vote? Maybe it's not. We vote in private booths for a reason. Right. <laughs> He's funny. Maybe I can teach them Shakespeare. <laughs> Betty's already been overseer once. Has she? Oh. What happened? What do you mean she was overseer once? What? Oh, do they do re-elections? Interesting. 
I wonder how long the turnaround is. Oh, am I kidding? Doesn't even believe in himself. I'm getting a lot of Last of Us vibes. Like just the shots. The 320 years of American history. Oh, is this the exposition part? Okay. You guys use pre-war technology to find and collect pre-war technology to make sure no one has pre-war technology? When you say it like that, it's weird. What do you mean it's weird? You should know why. You're part of the Brotherhood. Are you armed? No. They are. Beans? You're scary. Oh my god, you are... Oh my god. Oh, beans. Oh. I'm pretty sure she has a 10 millimeter pistol. I used to love that pistol. Fiends. Yes. It's just a scratch. No, it's not. It happens all the time. It went full in there. <laughs> I voted for Betty. Why is he telling? <laughs> not to mention Steph's from Vault 31. I don't understand. So they're combined. So Vault 30, 33 and 31 live together. But why was the Vault 32 separate then? I don't get what? I just, okay. So the Overseer is the leader of all three vaults. But yeah, why was Vault 32 hidden away? Why was it Vault 32 integrated with the other two vaults? You know, am I missing something? Infected? This is more than just a graze. I mean, you should have been out. It's it's right in the middle of his arm. You should you know that it's more than a graze. There could be anything in there. Like a first aid kit. Lucy. Why is he such a little bitch? I don't understand. Is that rad roaches? That noise? That hissing noise? Why did they split up? Oh my god! Can you do like a more evil face? Like a more suspicious face? What happened to her? Where are we? Yeah. It's okay. We're in a vault. What? I don't under... What? I'm so confused with everything. Most things that have happened in this episode. What a weird episode. I mean, it doesn't help that I was so caught off guard by Maximus's sudden change in personality. I don't know, maybe I'm being too harsh again. You know, I mean, his life, like I said, is threatened, but still just, I don't know, it just feels weird. I felt this episode was weird. And I also don't understand, was I not paying enough attention? I don't understand the structures of the vaults. I thought that they were all the same vault. I thought they were all the people who were vault in Vault 33. And then they were trading with Vault 32 with the marriage. But then it's the Vault 32 ended up being dead. So I thought that Vault 31 just kept was but now they're together? I don't I'm so confused. I'm so confused. How did they get in a vault? I don't get it. Oh, whatever. Alright, episode two. That seemed like a short episode as well. I was wondering how that cyclops overseer or whoever he was was going to factor in as well because we haven't seen him yet i guess he'll be here somewhere but you're a shell mate now that right there is vault four's three foot thick lead casing it sounded hollow to me well there hasn't been a nuclear incident has there <laughs> america will be ready you're creepy you're both very creepy by purchasing a residence in a vault tech vault today this is so disturbing. Knowing what we know about the vaults, this is so disturbing. Starring in a man and his dog. I'm ever ready to serve. <laughs> Hogsworth. Does he do the record? Does he voice the... Does he lend his voice to the Mr. Handys or something? Or maybe he's the voice actor and it's an Easter egg. Sell my vocal rights to that spinning robot they sell yeah. to housewives and perverts. Guess how much they paid me for that? Ten million? <laughs> Is he the actual voice actor? You're a product, I'm a product. The end of the world is a product. It's also predatory, isn't it? It's just gross. 
about oh. Ew. Oh. Our surface foragers are bringing it back now. That's so weird. So it's a functioning vault, an open vault. Who lets people? How is this born on the surface? I don't have this. Wow. Okay. You want to have sex? I'm a knight. We're not supposed to. That's right. Dance was a tough nut to crack, but you know, got there in the end. <laughs> Test subjects. Yeah, this is very. This this whole vault is very fishy. Very fishy. I think these people are trying to trap us here. Now, some of these people are from the surface, like you. Exactly. <laughs> this is a cult. Mm. Same as any. Everyone's smiling. I mean, you're from a cult. Maximus. I like that she eats too. You know? None of this. Benjamin, this is Lucy and Titus. Hi, hey Benjamin. Guys. Stay out of level 12, obviously. Obviously, why is that obvious? Is he a part of the experiments? Welcome to Vault 4. You don't think you should mention your your situation? Oh my god. Oh what the fuck? Hi. That was weird, right? No, not at all. Lots of people have one eye. In the middle of the head? It guarantees us a spot in the vault. We, we can buy a spot in the vault. One of the good vaults. What the That's fuck? Yeah, what the fuck? So you know. Voltex the fucking devil, man. Uh-huh. You really think Barb's a devil? Uh, yes, actually, yeah. If she knows what's going on, she's a fucking devil. Sorry, not sorry. You should learn the truth about where your wife works, for her sake. Why is it for her sake? She already knows. <laughs> if anything, it would be to her detriment. Who decided that there were no dogs in the vault? Voltex. Goosey McLean. It's Lucy. Nope, it says Goosey. Oh, you're right. That is my name. All I know is it was a huge bomb. <laughs> Pretty <laughs> good, right? <laughs> Trust doesn't come easily to those of us with a guilty conscience. That's not true. You don't have to have a guilty conscience to be wary or smart or perceptive. That is very uncomfortable. You're very cramped up against the wall. Not much movement there. Hey. Weirdo. Sugar bombs. Interesting wallpaper. Remembering Shady Sands. So what happened to the NCR? Shady Sands becomes capital of the NCR. The NCR becomes the largest economic and political power in California. The fall of Shady Sands. What? What happened? Oh, the big oh! Oh God, I'm such a sucker for thing. Oh, for music and oh, uh, excuse me. That is one of my favorite things about Fallout 4. The music. There aren't, aren't many favorite things about Fallout 4, but the music was was good. He really wasted that opportunity, didn't he? He could have left with all of that stuff. Oh, come on now, so are we old friends, ain't we? I don't know why you would trust that face. We're old friends, aren't we? <laughs> with dipshits like yourself. Oh, oh, oh. Is something gonna happen with that needle? This is so tense. I'm so tense. Oh, I must have killed nine or ten people. My daddy lives in Philly. Hopefully he was one of them, bitch. Don't Ooh. take the bait, son. My daddy ain't no coward. Then he's probably dead. <laughs> oh. What a, a wasting bullets. How are you supposed to know which one's yours? Oh my god, it is a cop. Oh, okay, we're getting... Are we basking in the radiation? It's ashes, By don't do that. Ourselves in their ashes. Yes. I'm a big fan. Cryogenics, I'm assuming. A different cult. <laughs> I thought it was the cult, the children of Adam. Which would be weird being in a bowl, but I thought maybe that was the reason for all the abnormalities. 
radiation exposure. These people are insane. Yeah, they're like you, but nice. <laughs> I'm gonna prove it to you, okay? You're not gonna tell him what happened? Use your- Oh, that's so annoying! That's such a fucking trope! Tell him what happened! Such a- Oh, such a lazy fucking tactic, you know? Fucking- Oh, I hate that shit. So lazy. No communication between characters, you know? For the plot. But for conflict. Be vague as possible. What the fuck is that? Is that, um, the gobbler or whatever it was? Or is that a gecko? I couldn't really tell. What the fuck? Oh, oh god! The music again. Was this the answer? Thank you, darling. Oh my god. <laughs> You thought. <laughs> oh my God. That's about all the worst shit I can take. <laughs> She's not even saying anything. Sorry, I didn't hear what you said. I said that this is about all the worst shit I can take. <laughs> His ancestors were used as lab rats by the original residents of Vault 4. The oh, fuck? That's so fucked up. Red Rocket. <laughs> oh. <gasps> Oh my god, oh I'm gonna fucking die. Shit. Oh my god. It's not food, okay? Oh, oh my god. Uh putting that sock back on would your big toe was dangling. Nuka cola. What the it's fuck? Bigger than you. It's bigger than all of us. You can breathe in there, right? You'll just starve to death. Wow, pretty brutal for such a peaceful community. Banishment to the surface! <laughs> That's why we're giving you two weeks of supplies. <laughs> After that, you okay. are on your own, Goosey. <laughs> That's, uh... <laughs> Let us go! <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Dead? Fucking hell. Somebody made you check on him? No, uh, fucking hell. <laughs> I can. I can. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> oh, it's him. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh. Is this real? What? Oh, is that um? You know when you get when you have cripple, but when you cripple your limbs. And you can use stim packs in like to isolate and your limbs just is that what that's supposed to be you know <laughs> this is radioactive as hell well, you don't have to worry about that anymore what did what did he mean by that what's happening what the fuck what happened yeah poison rat poison mm. someone obviously does chat he's talking can you wait we all are, Norm. That's why we live in a vault. I mean, you were born here. You didn't choose to... Okay. You were literally born there. You can't leave. How does that make you a coward? I can't believe he did that. What the fuck? What did he do? That's mids, right? Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> wow. They're just so ignorant to music. It's kind of sad, <laughs> I would say. Totally. <laughs> yep. Oh my god. Shit. Yeah. Okay. What the fuck? You just stood there while he was shooting? Why am I not dead? Because of that thing? That elixir? Whatever the fuck it was? Oh my god. What the fuck is he? I think you might be a ghoul. Yeah, I was thinking the same. The Brotherhood. Shit. Yeah, you can't go back now either. They'll kill me if they find out. Yeah. The Brotherhood is the good guys? It's a complicated right? organization. <laughs> I'm fine. I love how he just becomes the dad now. You're my new husband. <laughs> Who's gonna make their new suits? They need new suits. To say 32. Oh, there we go. <laughs> You're gonna get her into trouble. How are you going to explain your lies? Oh, someone fixed the stairs. They're in Philly, yeah? It looks like Philly. It's not the first time brother in your company has fallen into misfortune. 
She wasn't in his company. They were in the crib room or whatever it's called. He died running. Well, he didn't have any backup. Do we get to see the outcasts at all? What you say is true. You and I, we will take power. Why did you try to deceive us? How about that? How about asking that? Are you not curious why he tried to deceive you? Why would he say that? Why would he want to work with him like that? Well done! Sunset Tasparilla! Good! I can't remember his name. I'm, I'm heading out. I like her coat. <laughs> Go away, whatever your now. name is. Oh, Lucy. Do you mind if I bring him by just to meet you for a moment? Oh, God. Of course. Salespeople are the oh, worst. Wait, I didn't get it's all the names. I need to go back. Tech. Welcome. Vault Tech. Robco West Tech. Big M. Was that house? Robco? Come on, Barb. Set him straight. Yeah, sure. Who will inherit the earth after we've wiped the surface clean? Sounds like the enclave. We could intentionally overcrowd a vault so people have to compete to survive inside it. Before. We could separate parents and children, and only the smartest kids reach adulthood. God, that de aging looks a bit. It, it does not look good. And war, well. War never changes. War never changes. Well done. <laughs> Thanks, friend. And took her children. She found this wonderful city. But then what her city? husband what was came city? after her. Oh my god. Why did you just keep her like that for however many decades? I don't know what this fusion thing means. What does it do? What's it supposed to do? Cold fusion, whatever that is. You've seen what it's like up here. Yeah, because of you. Because of greed and power. In order to survive. Because of you. Alright, so there the NCS. Ooh. Shit. We very weird how they don't have a torch. You know what I mean? Built in. Lucy. Oh, You're coming with me. Is he gonna shoot him? No. Okay. So just distribute power throughout the wasteland, I guess. Maybe you can stop them. Sure. You killed her. No. Death. Yes. Shut up. Okay. A death claw skeleton. All right. Skull. I guess it'll have to do. <laughs> Ooh. There it is. It's fucked up. God, I have so many thoughts and feelings right now. I wish so much that I could just clap and just praise this so much. I really, really do. Oh, but I don't know. I found this half of the series, these last four episodes, I got bored. I got really bored. It lost me. And when you lose me, it's extremely hard to get me back. Um, there were some things, some references in here from this first half as well. Like, I don't know, correct me if I'm wrong, but you know that the story of about the, the kid that was in the fridge and he was in there for so long, he was a ghoul when they opened it. You know, little references like that with Maximus in the fridge, with dog meat at Rob, the Robco or the station. Just, you know, obvious reference from the games. I just find that so cringe, you know? This is canon, right? So you're referencing things that have already happened. And just for the sake for people like me to be like, oh, and you know granted it does work sometimes it does the music when you hear the music from the games i i fangirl i do i just it just gets me it gets me right in the feels seeing the brotherhood armor really even now even still seeing that brotherhood it it, it makes me feel a certain type of way you know 
but I find it cringe. I, I the, the little references, I do. Um, I don't like the ending. So what? So it was Vault Tech that was that was behind the bombs falling. Really? We? I don't know. I, I'm not. I'm not the. I know a lot about the Fallout world. I do. I know a lot of the lore, but I'm not an expert. You know, I find it hard to believe that doing this doesn't doesn't ruin the integrity of the established law we we have and also it doesn't fucking make sense like you have these or one i just <laughs> when they were all talking like oh we can make a vault where where we we just have everyone star because there's not enough people oh oh no we can have a vault where where it just seemed like it was very mu mustache twirling like yes yeah, sure that's why they did all those all those experiments just for the kick just for the fun yeah like it just seemed very very cartoon villainy it just seemed really really just ridiculous and also their, their their reasoning makes no fucking sense they they want to incite this war so then in 200 years they can control everything but you have so many companies you've got robco you've got fucking vault tech you've got all the, so when you wake up you're in the same place you're still divided you're not you know what it's so fucking stupid and it's like the enclave really that's the enclave thing yeah let's just kill everyone up in the surface and then we can arise and we can rebuild the world in our image but in this instance it's not your image you're different companies you all want power so you're gonna start in the exact same fucking place yeah it's human nature you know to always want power to always want to be the one in power which is why we're left in the position we're in now you've got fucking the brotherhood you've got the ncr you've got these little cults as well because everyone thinks they're right because everyone wants their own it's no it's just and that's fallout yeah and that's that's not what i'm criticizing i'm criticizing the ending like i don't i didn't like it like i said i find it hard to believe that it doesn't ruin already established law people that are much more versed in the law will be able to 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 know that better than me but i just find it really hard to believe i'm not invested in lucy's and maximus's relationship either um, I like as characters, individual, I like them. I don't have an issue with them, but in their relationship, I'm not invested, you know? Um, I don't get anything really from their, yeah, their relationship. I did like the twist in the end that the raiders or, or the, the people that infiltrated the vault were NCR. I did see the flag when we entered that room. Um, you know, I was like, wow, why is that flag there? I guess I didn't get it until much later on. Um, yeah, I did like that twist that they, they were the NCR. Um, yeah, that was cool. Yeah, I'm still very curious as to what, what has gone down and what, what, what was the law? Like, like, what was the, what's the canon ending for Fallout 4? What did they go with? And also, um, New Vegas. Does it even matter because it's been, it has been so long? Sure, it does matter. It, it, it does. I just, I want to know, you know? Um, I want to know what happened uh, between the the battle of with the NCR and Legion and House. Did the NCR win? Did House, you know? I want to know what happened at the end of Fallout 4. Did the rail, no, the railroad no they didn't win. but did the brotherhood win where's the institute i'm sure not not everything needs to be answered here i understand that i totally accept that that's fine you can't claim everything into one season i'm just curious to know where all that stands so i am assuming that while well, they are planning on a season two by that ending i wonder if they're going to get it I'm pretty sure they will. Um, yeah, don't know where they're going to go from here. Um, yeah, I knew that nothing was going to happen with the father and with um, just that ending. I knew because they need you need to carry that tension over, that rivalry. They couldn't just kill him then and there. Um, interesting what happened with the squire as well, him being a ghoul now. 
that's interesting. I wonder how fast his he'll transform. Mm, interesting. I'm glad he's not dead though. I did find him quite funny, even though he left dog meat. Yeah, his name is dog meat. Again, I don't like that, you know, like dog meat was our dog you know i know that dog meat was always the name of every dog in every game but that was that's like a game thing like i don't know bringing it here it's cringe like i said like ugh, get it get it we get it we know it's a game we know you don't have to bring it here you know it's ugh. Yeah, I still don't understand the vaults, um, how they work, the three vaults. I, it's confusing to me. Maybe I will after maybe going away for a bit and thinking about it. I'll be like, oh, yeah, right, I get it. It was just very confusing um, having the three vaults and, and the, yeah, so, yeah, so I guess the way that they communicated was the overseers could communicate via the computer so i guess you know that's how it worked um i wonder how many people in vault 33 were actually are uh, the the people that were unfrozen and how many are the legit the people born into the vault you know yeah again nowhere near as good as the first four episodes i don't know it just it felt different it, it really really went down for me yeah Oh well, um, overall it was fine, it was, it was fine. Um, I am very concerned about the ending and what it does to the law. That was my main concern about this show in the beginning is that they were going to mess with the games by messing with the law because it's canon. Um, that's always a fear, especially with Star Wars, you know, what went on with Star Wars yeah um that was always that was my biggest thing so i don't know people a lot more knowledgeable than me well yeah can speak on that but i don't know i'm just very skeptical that it hasn't that it hasn't ruined anything by what they chose to go with but yeah war never changes like oh my god so eye rolling i'm one of those people who love that line i do i don't think it can be used enough in uh, every put it in every single game and i will get goosebumps i don't care but to bring it here not once but twice i think or did they do it three times i don't know but to bring it here along with the other things I mentioned and I'm sure there are more references that I missed as well cringe really fucking cringe um I didn't like it I'm just emotionally drained right now um I think I'm sad I think I'm very I don't know I feel I feel very I don't know um I don't know what I feel very disappointed upset maybe a little bit angry as well because I do feel like they did change the history of everything. Um, I don't know. But yeah. Um, yeah. I don't know. Maybe I'll feel differently later on. I, I, I don't know. I just feel a little bit. Oh, okay. Cool. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. And I am very curious to know what you thought about the series um what do you think about the route that they went do you feel are you happy with what they did at the ending their little their little enclave-esque meeting about dropping the bombs themselves for money for capitalism for corporations for greed i don't know what do you think about that i'm very very curious to know i don't know what the reception is um i don't watch any videos or reviews on anything that i'm playing or anything that i'm watching while i'm playing that or while i'm watching because i don't want it to i don't want it to affect my my opinions my views i don't want it to yeah so i have no idea what people think about this but yeah those are my thoughts thank you for listening if you're still here thank you again for watching i will see you for the next one bye